We're back again to look at race number 11. This again is the third division of the 96 Jug Preview, the 27th edition. Doug, here in the 11th race, we have another field of seven. Who do you like here in the third division? I guess I have to go along with the, uh, the fans here, the four to five favorite, G.G. Digger, California Horse of the Year in 1995, the first time in that state that a two-year-old ever received that honor. And his time of 154 and two fifths seconds was the fastest for a two-year-old in the history of the state of California, which has to say something for the state of harness racing out in California. But uh, since then, uh, if we question the 154 and two, you certainly can't question the fact that this, is, this horse has raced twice now under one minute and 50 seconds. No three-year-old in history has ever done that. And this will be the last stakes race because this is a horse not eligible for the job. Correct. It's hard to go against a horse with two sub-150 miles. We've seen quite a number of sub-150 miles this year from the Meadowlands, but we have never seen a three-year-old under 150. G.G. Digger likes to come from well off the pace, and as the interview mentioned earlier, G.G. Digger uh, favors early speed in the front and likes to come from behind. That's the way he was, that's the way he set up the win in 149 and 3 just two starts ago against older horses he has taken his records against older horses at the Meadowlands. I would question a little bit though the fact uh, that this horse is raced in 149 and before you just you know bet the bet the mortgage you know or the house on, on the horse uh, the Meadowlands is about three seconds faster than the track at Sciota according to comparative figures so if you add three seconds on to the 149 you still come out with 152 which a number of these horses are, are doing tonight. And stakes record is 152 and 1. The first division went in 152 and 2, and the second division here in 52 and 4. So, so we're I, all around it. I expect yeah. I expect the 11th race to go a tick faster here. I'll take Oyve, the uh, six horse to come in second. This is a horse that was purchased for ten thousand dollars, and then went on to win four hundred and fifty thousand dollars to this point. And he was uh, third in the cane at Yonkers, the final of the cane. I'll go with the two horse. Let's put in an Ohio bred end here. Crisp Sauber currently at five to two. Obviously, a local favorite. Crisp Sauber, the only two-year-old in the entire country who was undefeated last year in 11 starts, 11 wins. He cut it close several times. This year now in 12 starts has nine wins including the $100,000 Ohio Stakes Sire Stakes final at Northfield Park. He likes to race to the front end. The key here is if Miller can get him back down to the half, he'll need yeah. some moderate fractions in between. Yeah, Chris Sauber was also a bargain basement uh, sort of horse at $13,200. Uh, Cannonball, Sabra, full brother, then went for about uh, $27,000 last year. Now they have another one, what called Chili? Chili Sabra. Who will be in the sale here at Scioto Downs during Jug Week. From there, I go to the Six Oars Ori They. This call, of course, with over a quarter, rather over $462,000 in earnings, and comes off a Simcoe Stake final a win at uh, Mohawk in 152 and 4 has already won four starts this year including the very quick 150 and 3 at Vernon Downs and interesting to see that uh, live or die the number one horse is 17 to 1 this was a great horse last year winning $685,000 this year however down to uh, $22,000 he was the winter book favorite to be the top three-year-old of the year. He was first in the experimental ratings. He gets Bill Fahey tonight, and maybe Bill Fahey will know how to make this horse live again. Well, we certainly agree on the 11th race winner here, the four GG Digger. I'll go with the four over the two and the six. And I will go with the six or two and be very happy if the two does better than the six. Well, we'll have blasts and uh, two minutes now until post time, just two minutes until post. Uh, good luck tonight for the third division of the Jug Preview.